We're here at the Zebra App Forum in Sydney and joining me is Nathan Clevenger, the Director of Customer Development at Zebra. Thanks for joining me. Hi Andrew, nice to be here. Now today we're taking a look at Savannah, the all new system that Zebra has uh, launched. Now, what is Savannah? <laughs> so Savannah is the platform that takes all of the data and APIs that we've traditionally had at the device level and, br and brings that to the cloud. There are a lot of great features of the Savannah solution. What are some that excite you? Yeah, well, one of the most exciting features uh, and capabilities, in my opinion, is the RFID read to cloud. So traditionally, RFID solutions have required an on-premise server, um, which for certain types of solutions where you might only have a, a few RFID readers at a particular location, um, it costs a lot of money, not only to put the, the hardware in, but then to manage and support that. But if you can plug in a reader and then get two things over that one cable connection, power over Ethernet and cloud over Ethernet, now your RFID tags can read directly to the cloud, enabling a whole new category of RFID applications that weren't possible before. There's a lot of talk about the blockchain. Now, how does Savannah integrate with the blockchain? Yeah, well, in, in many ways, I, I think blockchain is one of those terms that has been uh, overhyped in, in many situations and ways. But um, one of the things that we, that we realized in conversations with our customers is that one of the biggest challenges that our customers were facing is how to connect the physical world to a digital blockchain. Well, that is what Zebra does. So a product that's manufactured, from the point of manufacture, um, a label is printed that has the identity, the batch lot serial number of that product. That barcode is scanned as it flows through the supply chain from that manufacturer to other distributors onto a retailer. And by leveraging the fact that our, our printers, our mobile computers, our barcode scanners, our RFID readers are all connected to the cloud out of the box, without doing any expensive systems integration, our customers can record that print job, every scan, um, any RFID read directly to a blockchain for out-of-the-box blockchain traceability, which, which we're really excited about as an industry first. A critical part of the Savannah solution is having software developers integrate into it. Yeah. How does it actually happen? Well, for many years, um, Zebra developers have been using on-device APIs and SDKs. And historically, our developer portal um, had tens of thousands of pages of documentation around these APIs, but they were all at the device level of how to print over USB or Bluetooth or scanning uh, over a USB scanner or on a, 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 a Android mobile computer, for example. But now, for the first time, all of those APIs and capabilities can be accessed through the cloud. And so, um, it's subtle, but it enables our developer ecosystem to work with a whole new category of developer that maybe has never worked with Zebra in the past. Zebra work very closely with the software community. Yeah. If a software developer or partner has some suggestions on what Zebra should be doing, how can they go about doing that? Oh, great question. So one of the new capabilities of our recently launched developer portal is the new Savannah Sandbox. Uh, this allows uh, the community to propose ideas and concepts for new APIs and we can get feedback from the community on which are the uh, API concepts and ideas that, that people are most interested in. We can also um, develop uh, prototypes of, of new APIs before they're officially launched to allow our, our uh, customers to get a preview and provide feedback before everything is finalized. And so it's a way that we at Zebra have been able to accelerate uh, the time to market for a lot of these new APIs by leveraging uh, the sandbox. For any developers out there that want to work with Zebra, where should they go for more information? Yeah, they, they can visit developer.zebra.com. They can create an account, get an API key and start using the APIs within a few minutes.